uh, really, really excited about coming to Trinity Western just because everything is new. Um, never been to university before, and to be in this kind of environment, this close campus, uh, everything's in touch and distance, all the facilities are there, all the people you need are there, um, and just the, uh, just just going to university and being able to continue training is a, is a great, great opportunity. I hadn't really thought about it, uh, just I was happy doing what I was doing, working and training, and, Juggling that about worked really well. Uh, so, to Laurie kind of made me realise that it's not enough to basically just work full time with no qualifications and then just keep trying to train because his point is that after once you hit about 30 and you're done with track and field, then what have you got left? You've still got so much, so much more left in your life to, to do, so much more to accomplish. and. Uh, it's going to be down to a lot more than just track and field. I've, I've came from a kind of sprints, sprints and uh, hard rolls background, so it's all been uh, 110 hard rolls and long jump as a kid, but uh, slowly, like, slowly but surely I've been kind of stepping up and I've found my way to kind of up to 200s, some 4x4s, and uh, Laurie thinks I'm going to be perfect for the four, 400 hard rolls, so uh, I haven't got a PB. Uh, nothing on paper yet, but uh, I'll have my first 400 turtles sometime, uh, sometime maybe this year anyway, and uh, a good few 400, so hopefully some good PBs will go up on the, the boards. It's, it's nice and small, it's, uh, it's not over the top like in Glasgow, it's kind of everything's spread out throughout a big city, and you can find different buildings owned by different universities, basically in the opposite side of the city. And, things like that, but everything here is, I like, I like the dorms as well, like it's right in the centre of it all, so you're never too far away from anything. He's good, uh, he's, I was I was thinking, uh, he's, he always tries to come across as a wee bit more than just a coach, so the fact that he's been able to convince me to want to do something about my education uh, shows that it's, it's not just track and field to him as well, he's it's uh, all about the person he's dealing with as well, and uh, the good thing is he's a very he's very on top of the uh, injury prevention. So as before, I would be injured and I'd want to rush back because I'm desperate to get back on the track and start running again. But that's not always the best. In fact, very rarely is that the best option. So uh, he's really on top of things. Make sure you take it slow uh, and to keep keep you fit for a long time. So it's all about piecing together more training sessions rather than having a big break where you've just pulled a hamstring or something like that.